Hey, what's up guys? It's Steven with another video for you. Now, people love Apple, people love iPhones. There's all different types and sizes of iPhones now, but the software still remains the same across the board. So what I decided to do is put together a series of videos just for people who love Apple, and I will show you everything that I can find that you need to know besides, you know, jailbreaking it and doing some weird things, but I'll show you how to use the iCloud, the iTunes, everything. So subscribe to my channel now with the little floating subscribe button. Just press it and uh, go and give a thumbs up for any videos you like and share it with your friends. So the first one we're going to do is just the basic setup and how to do an update to get to the new 9.3 software. So uh, let's get started. All right, let's go ahead and do a quick unboxing. Here you have the phone. Here you get like a little starter's guide. You get the SIM card remover. So on the side here. You're going to stick that into a little hole to remove the SIM card if you need to add one into it. You get a setup guide. Inside the box, you have a charger USB cable, the battery port to plug into the wall, and you have some uh, speakers and headphones to put in your ear. This also has a built-in microphone so you can talk. So you're going to look for your power button on your iPhone. A lot of the new 6's are on the side, but this one's on top. Just press that. You'll get a hello screen. Unlock it at the bottom. Choose your language. Choose your country. And then you're going to need to either set up with Wi-Fi or with cellular. Wi-Fi is the best way to go because you may have to back up things or update things from your previous install. So it's going to work better. So let's go ahead and choose one of these uh, Wi-Fi's and enter the password. Now your phone needs to activate. Get location. Now we're going to set up the Touch ID. So what you want to do is go ahead and press it. And then you're going to have to hold down this Touch ID until it asks you to lift. So let's see here. So first you're going to put your hand like this, lift finger, place it again, lift finger, place it again, and you'll feel a vibration. So now you want to continue. Now it needs to get the edges of your fingers. Keep in mind, you want to hold down to it, ask you to change it because I keep doing this. Hit continue. Now it's going to ask you to create a password. Now you can do six digits, but for demo purposes, I'm going to hit passcode options. And you can see you can customize anything you want. I'm going to do four digits. Now to drop down to four dots. One, two, three, four. Nope. Oh. And it warns you, said this is a common code. I know it's just for a demo. Now it asks you do you want to restore from iCloud, iTunes, create as a new phone, or move data from Android, which is a new option, which is cool. Now those gonna this is a series of videos, so you're gonna see all these options pops up in some other videos I create. For now, let's set up as a new iPhone. It's gonna ask for Apple ID. I'm gonna say that I don't have one. If you have one, definitely go ahead and enter it in. You can create a Apple right there or, or actually reset your password. I'm going to not set it to iPhone for now. Terms and conditions, read through that thoroughly. Hit agree at the bottom. And do you want Siri to be on? This last part is do you want to send uh, data to Apple? In case, you know, something's going on with your phone. And then go ahead and get started. So let's do updates. Settings. 
general software update and let it check for updates now it has a 9.3 update 293 megabytes click download put in your password one two three four and then it'll start downloading after you read through the terms and condition once again update is requested now it's starting to download the file right there and it should be complete at the top here you can say see where it says five minutes remaining and it'll count that down for you so after it prepares everything it asks you do you want it to go ahead and in install and you can hit now or later if you hit later it'll stay in uh, a state where you can just uh, go ahead and hit continue uh, if you hit later then it'll actually eventually keep prompting you to update the files if it's done correctly you should get this line going across with the Apple logo so the update is complete let's go and unlock it and let's go and see which version it's on now general about and it's on 9.3.1 so thanks for watching this video again this is part of a series and anyone who subscribes are going to get emailed out as soon as I put another one online now there will be other videos that I will be putting out because I have Samsung I have some other portable units that's been sent to me so please bear with me as I get through this process so again comment below what kind of video you need and uh, like all my videos subscribe Give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.